In 1997, AI surpassed humans in chess when IBM's Deep Blue defeated Garry Kasparov. Almost 20 years later in 2016, DeepMind's AlphaGo defeated Go world champion Lee Sodol. For now, humans still rule at Olympiad Mathematics, but DeepMind announced last year that they had achieved a silver medal IMO performance with their models Alpha Proof and Alpha Geometry. The IMO is the most prestigious math competition in the world. Each country is represented by its six strongest high school math students. The competition goes over two days. Each day, contestants have four and a half hours to solve three problems. Although the problems are designed to be achievable with only high school math, these problems are hard, even for professional mathematicians. I should clarify that a gold medal doesn't mean you have to come first overall. Gold medals are awarded to approximately one in 12 contestants after the grade boundaries are determined. IMO problems are a great test for AI because solving them requires more than just brute force computation. You need to discover underlying connections and apply concepts in a creative way. As Daniel Selson from OpenAI said, they are designed to require tremendous ingenuity, even for people who have studied all previous problems and their solutions. Daniel was one of the founders of the IMO Grand Challenge in 2020 for an open source AI to win an IMO gold medal. In 2024, XTX Marcus announced a $10 million prize for artificial intelligence in mathematical Olympiads. $5 million will go to the first open source AI that wins an IMO gold medal. The other $5 million will be split into smaller progress prizes. The first progress prize was won by Project Numina, who fine-tuned a base model from DeepSeek using tool-integrated reasoning. This is where large language models are integrated with external computational libraries. Basically, the LLM is given power to execute Python code, and from the output, it then reasons about the next step to take. The second progress prize went to a team from NVIDIA who fine-tuned a quen based model, again using tool-integrated reasoning and a curated data set of thousands of Olympiad problems. So how do these progress prize competition problems compare to actual IMO problems? The progress prize problems are all original, created by a high-powered team of mathematicians. The Progress Prize 2 problems were created to be comparable to national level Olympiad problems, so not quite IMO level, but not far off. The NVIDIA team's model answered 34 out of 50 of these questions correctly. Here are two of the problems. Feel free to pause the video if you want to try them yourself. I'll leave the answers in the comments and a link to the solutions. Another key difference is that the Progress Prize questions have all been answer only, with all the answers being integers. IMO problems require a complete mathematical proof. DeepMind's alpha proof model does output proofs, formal proofs in a language called Lean. Here is part of its solution to IMO 2024 problem one. Note that the comments in pink were translations of the Lean code added by humans afterwards. Now, I can't help you with the Lean code, but if you want to understand the problem, which was a lovely problem combining number theory and algebra, here's a link to my video explanation from last year. The 2025 IMO is about to kick off in Australia. Google DeepMind have a good chance at a gold medal. No doubt OpenAI, Meta and the Chinese big tech companies will be in the mix too. But they're all unlikely to beat this guy. This is Shi Haojia. He was the only contestant in the world in 2024 to achieve a perfect score. And it was the second time he'd done it. He also achieved a perfect score in 2023, and he'll be back one more time in 2025 to try to make it three in a row. No doubt the Chinese team will also be looking to regain the top spot after being outdone by the USA and Korea last year. Once the problems are out, I'll do a video explaining one of the problems and put a link here. Thanks for watching.